So they his name, but if y'all do want to see his Twitter, it's like Dimes Only TV is his Twitter. If y'all want to go look at his or whatever, but then it's a problem star. He do map. But his face never in it, but... Just when we thought Summer Walker's dating life couldn't get no messier, she and her ex-boyfriend Lil Meech just got into it after he went off on her for dating a corn star. Apparently, Summer's new man is known very well for doing OnlyFans and scamming people out of thousands of dollars. And word on the street is, he's planning on doing the same thing to her. In fact, he's scammed several women out of their money and they've all ganged up on him to expose him. As soon as Summer posted that man on her page. And as if things couldn't get any more embarrassing for Summer, Lil Meech just stepped into the chat and dragged her for filth for even entertaining this man without knowing him. Now, if y'all remember, Meech and Summer had a very toxic on again, off again relationship, but they called it quits after he was caught cheating on her multiple times. The most famous incident of him cheating was when he was caught on CCTV footage sneaking into another woman's apartment to blow her back he claimed that at the time, the woman was his cousin and that he was just helping her to get some groceries into her apartment, but nobody believed that BS because it was a lie. He and Summer were spotted a few times after that, but they eventually decided to hang it up and gone and separate for good. Meech just could not stop cheating and Summer was honestly over it. Honestly, it seems like Summer's bad luck with men ain't slowing down no time soon because she recently announced that she has a new man and within minutes of posting him, folks started doing some digging and they found some very disturbing information about him. It all started a few days ago when Summer Hard launched her new boo as part of her 28th birthday celebration. This came as a shock to people because they thought she was still single and taking a break from dating since her relationship with Meech didn't end too well. People started digging around to know more about this mystery man and they found out his name is actually Coop Washington. Not only that, he's been making a lot of posts on Facebook days prior to Summer posting him and it seemed like he really liked Summer. He made several posts like this one that said, finally know what true love feels like. My girlfriend is so beautiful, it's crazy. We about to manifest twins. Happy birthday to the love of my life. I love you more than life itself. We locked in for L. For a moment, it looked like Summer had finally settled down with somebody reasonable enough to cuddle up with and be around her kids. That was until several women came out to expose him him, and y'all could not believe the things this man has been up to. One woman accused Coop of illegally posting her photos online that she had sent him privately while they were dating. She said, OMG, this the guy who exposed me in 2015. Most of the ish that's out there of me without my consent, I sent to him and he posted it when I said I didn't want to talk to him anymore. OMG, this is crazy and evil. Miss B Nasty had an issue with him too too, shaking my head. There's also another woman who said Coop tried to manipulate her into making adult content with him for his OF. Apparently he does OF and usually tricks the women he's dating into doing it by telling them to make a private tape. Once they make that tape with him, he usually either posts it on his own OF without their consent or threatens them with it for money. This woman said, when I met this man, I didn't know he had an OF because I met him on IG through his photography page, Love legends. It wasn't until after our first link, he told me he had an OF account, but he would delete it if we made an account together. I wasn't on that ish, so he kept the account up, but insisted that he was going to continue effing women on there, but it's only business and that he loved me, LMAO. So once I cut him off, not shortly after that, I see he done made a joint OnlyFan account with another girl. So I'm like, okay, this dude's strange, LMAO. But that was short-lived because a week later, Later, he reached back out to me confessing his love for me and then he deleted the OF account. And then there were these other two women who also accused him of the same thing. One of them even claimed he threatened to fly out to her city and violate her after she rejected his advances. He even went as far as to hacking her social media and locking her out of her own account. She said, he was telling me he loved me and when I declined, said he would pull up to my city and make me make love with him. He tells new models that we date and I've never even met him. He's locked models out of accounts. He runs their accounts like he's the model, etc. For a decade now. Another woman replied to this particular tweet and said, a decade ago, he pulled the same ish with me. He was acting like we was in a relationship and I never met him in person. He got real crazy real fast. 
He has serious issues. This happened to me nine years ago. Thank you so much for sharing as well. Things escalated even further when another woman accused him of SAing her and permanently damaging her ovaries. I wasn't gonna say anything, but Summer Walker's new boyfriend Coop was the guy that SA'd me in 2020, then stalked me for two years, messed me up so bad my ovaries collapsed. This man is the main reason I will never have any kids. He went by Poppy Lush at the time and has changed his name a million times. Stay away from this man. So much more to the story, but so many girls are saying stuff, so I decided to as well anyway. But this wasn't the end of this mess, because another one of Coop's victims called Pink Lips decided to go on IG and expose him for being a corn star. She said she and Coop initially linked up so he could manage her, but things started to get real weird after they collabed to do some adult content for her OF. She said she wasn't really feeling Coop like that, so she decided to keep their relationship strictly business, and that's when everything went south. Apparently, all this happened around last December, which was around the same time that Coop and Summer started talking. She said there was a point in time where Coop would send photos of Summer's kids to make her jealous. Off Twitter. Now, his name is Cooper or whatever the case may be. Um, I'm dropping this. I'll go because it's so crazy to me because oh, that is your the whole time. I he because he like, but he was like a manager, so he like was helping me do my little content, get my shit to the ground. Like he have a, uh, he was turning my shit up like my shit was like going crazy or whatever. Like my only fans and shit, I was getting mad followers. Like he his uh methods of how he was doing things was fire and he like archived all my old content, whatever, whatever. Um, he was just something like yo, we gotta do everything in 4K now. Like that's what can get everybody eye. That's what catch everybody eye. Whatever, whatever. So. Of course, I signed the contract. This is my manager or whatever case. He's my manager slash content partner. Because I everybody know I do solo content for him. This is like last year, y'all. I don't even talk, bother with him no more. So, y'all, boom. We signed the contract. It's my real manager, whatever the case may be. Um, He only was my manager for all the two weeks. It ended so f quick because I don't play that. So, y'all, boom. So, we on the phone. We used to be kicking on the phone, guys. Just talking about life or whatever the case may be. Uh, he told me like his fiance or wife or whatever. He like is a uh, R&B like a lit. He's like a famous R&B singer. She's rich, whatever, whatever. Um, I'm like, okay, you know, cool. You know me, I don't give a f who it is. I don't have nothing to do with me. So I was like, okay, you know that's what's up because me and him, I really have a business relationship. It's not nothing personal. It's just business. So y'all, he just always mentioned it. You know, like I ain't really like. He's like, you know, he was talking about past shit with other people. He was managing people, getting their feelings. And I'm like, why well, I'm not gonna ever get my feelings. I'm a player. At this is just business. We got a contract and all. Like, I don't know what you got going on. I still got other shit going on the side anyway. Like, you just manage me. You know what I'm saying? We do concerts. So, I end up finally linking it to do a, uh, uh, um, which one? What do I want to call it? We linked content. Put it like that. We collabed. Um, he was managing my pages because I don't have time. I say, content's annoying. I, I don't have a manager and I'm doing everything by myself. But before I was lazy, I would let somebody else just do all, post and do all that. Keep Twitter lit. I don't got time to do all that. I'll be busy. So, now... We end up collabing. Um, as y'all know, I don't know if y'all seen it. If y'all seen it, y'all seen it. If y'all did, y'all did. It's gone now because I don't know him. Um, you know, posted, did numbers. It was like two clips I think he posted or whatever the case. It be them clips, did a couple numbers, whatever have you. He started texting me on some personal or whatever the case may be. Now, everybody know I, I, I got good cool. So, of course, it can never stay professional with it. I know how to keep it professional because I'm not, I'm not no kid. I don't like to not be professional like don't move me you can't get him especially with then y'all know funny shit that's so mediocre like it wasn't even it wasn't nothing crazy it was some some average shit. like everybody that know me that seen that shit on twitter but if y'all do want to see his twitter it's like dimes only tv is his twitter if y'all want to go look at his shit or whatever but that was a problem he do map but his face never in it but but um you know i want to like oh my dog keep working i'm, I'm like i don't want to do more no more collabs i think i want to like focus on my solo shit or like girl on girl like i'm just trying to let him off easy i didn't want to just tell him he's trash because he's cool he's cool no i would not take off me and cool he's cool weird but he started texting me some personal so now he like oh um yeah, we just gonna void the contract i don't want to i can't manage you because it's hard it's harder for me to push girl on girl and solo i gotta put more work and i'm just over it crazy because i just see my cousin just shared it on facebook and i just look i zoomed in i said cool oh my gosh <laughs> I roll the tray fell. I'm like, oh my god, Coop is crazy. I got the video, everything. I'm, I I got a little clip of what we did, but I'm not sending that to nobody because it's a mess. My face looked like I was getting like I was being forced. It was a ch chips, y'all. I was a mess. But um, yes. So 
he like that for long to be. I'm like, no, no, don't. Since when? This ain't. This is a business relationship. I don't put you like that. Like you're you're delusional to think that you lay good pipe is crazy. Like it did not give that. It was a mess. Close my door. Uh, my wife is a whole famous R and B star. I'm not tripping over bitches who constant win man. It just ain't about. Shit. I'm like, I don't know who your wife is because he like he would never tell me who it is. I went ask. So I don't care, but he just kept always saying little shit about the the wife being famous. So I remember one time before we fell out or whatever, he texted me a picture of the twins, Summer Walker at the doctor with the twins. So I'm thinking he might be one of her managers or something or a backup singer or something like that. So I'm like, he might talk to somebody close to her or whatever because it's a personal picture of her at the doctor with the kids. Whole time, y'all come to find out that is his. Y'all, they and for those of y'all who are still in denial about the credibility of these women's stories, there are literally tweets from other women dating all the way back to 2021 who also accused him of the same thing. He and Summer weren't even linked together at the time, so there's no reason for them to hop on the internet and make it up. This is something Coop has been doing for a very long time, and Meech feels like he's gonna do the same thing to Summer. Even though he and Summer weren't the best couple, at least he wasn't out here scamming women, threatening women, and posting their private videos on OF without they consent. Now you would think all of this would make Summer do a little investigation and leave this man alone, but she decided to play in the face of all the victims by posting a video of her and Coop on vacation in Mexico to basically let everybody know she don't care. People did not take this very well and they all dragged her for filth. Like this person who said, Summer Walker is truly one of the most empty headed girls out here. How do you continuously go and get with the dumbest, most corniest, pathetic, clout chasing losers to be your boyfriend slash baby daddy? Like, please smash your current man's head between the stove and fridge because why is he sharing pictures of your children with his corn coworkers? Is he insane? Another person said, men are supposed to protect us, be our peace, our safe place, make us feel warm. Seeing how many men are defending Summer Walker's boyfriend after many S workers spoke on him being harmful, it's scary. Instead of us feeling protected, we have to hide from y'all and y'all are the ones doing the damage. This is why victims don't speak up. We as women will never win. But now I wanna know your thoughts. What do y'all think about Summer's boyfriend being a loser? And do y'all think Meech is right for going off on her? Y'all been knew what to do. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And don't forget to click here to watch this other very messy video.